Good morning, great future preschool. What a lovely day. Let's go inside and start our day. I wonder what those silly little babies have been up to while we've been gone. I am going to say hello to the fish. Good morning. Are you guys hungry? Let's give them a little bit of food. There you go. Okay. Let's see. Where are those babies? Not there anymore. Hmm. What? Oh my goodness. Little babies, what are you guys doing? Are you playing with some insects? Look at them. Look at this friend. Ah, it's crawling on your head. Oh my goodness. Silly babies. Let's see. Good morning. Good morning. Ah, good morning, friends. Oh, what a lovely day. I'm so happy that we are all back together in our circle time. Let's sing Good Morning to You. We haven't sung that song in a long time, so I will help you. Good morning, Oscar. Good morning, Rhea. Good morning, Kai and Kingston. Good morning, Bobby Ellen. Let's go a little faster. Good morning, Victor. Good morning, Hannah. Good morning, Judah. Good morning, Dayati. Good morning, Augie. Good morning, Charlie. Good morning, Joaquin. Good morning, Ren and Juliet. Good morning, Kayla. Good morning, Lakin. Good morning, Taylor. Good morning, Tristan. Good morning, Anna. Good morning, Max. Good morning, Roscoe. Good morning, Lucy. Good morning, Camille. Good morning, Harper. Good morning, Nova. Good morning, Miss. What's my name? Erin! That's right. Oh, wow. I had such a good sleep last night. I think I need to move my body. What do you guys think? How does that sound? So, make sure you have some space. Oh, I need to move my coffee. Let's move it away so I don't knock it over. And since we've been talking about insects, we are going to move like insects. Are you ready? Okay. So, first one, we are going to fly like a ladybug. Hmm, how does a ladybug fly? Get your little wings out and you can move around all around. You can get up and fly around your room if you have space. So fly around like a ladybug. Okay, now we're gonna buzz like a bee. Buzz like a bee. And, oh, this one's gonna be fun. Can you sway like a stick bug? They move really slow. They sway back and forth while they move. Swaying like a stick bug. Swaying like a stick bug. Okay, go back. We're swaying. How about climb like a spider? Get all your eight legs out. We're going to climb up the water spout. Climb up, 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 up. Stretch those arms. Stretch, 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 stretch. Climbing like a spider. Ooh. Now, I can't stand up because then you won't be able to see my head, but I'm going to pretend we're going to march so you guys can stand up. Okay? And we're going to march like an ant. March. 
page, page, page. We're marching like an ant. Marching like an ant. Okay, how about crawl like a caterpillar? Can you lay on your tummy and kind of crawl like a caterpillar? Back and forth. Oh, can you go backwards? Oh my goodness. How about flutter like a butterfly? Spread your big wings. Oh, what color are your wings? Today mine are purple and blue with black spots. That's what my butterfly wings look like today. What do yours look like? Mm. Okay, two more. We are going to jump like a grasshopper. So make sure, stand up. Make sure there's nothing around you that's gonna get hurt. And we're gonna jump, jump like a grasshopper. Jump, jump, jump. <laughs> Good job. And last one, we're gonna wiggle like a worm. How do wig worms wiggle? Wiggle through the mud, wiggle through the mud. Oh, great job, friends. Okay. Now, whew, that felt good. Stretching it out, stretching it out. Should we do some yoga? We, I found this cool pose. It is called tree pose. Can you see that little guy? Because I thought a lot of insects like to live in trees, climb in trees, spend time in trees. So let's make ourselves a tree so the insects have a place to hang out. Do you think we can do it? He's standing on one foot, his other foot's up, his arms are way up high. Okay, let's try it. Let's see. I don't know if you guys can see me. Maybe I scoot way back here. How's that? Kind of far away. Okay, what you're going to do first, put your hands on your hips. And you're going to start. And you're going to lift your leg up. Up, 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 as high as you can. Whoa, it's wiggly. And you're going to raise your arms up high. Wow, oh, good job. Whoa, it's hard. We get wiggly. If you get wiggly, that's okay. Just put your foot down so you don't fall. Good job. Okay, you ready? Sometimes the other side is a lot harder. Let's try. Whoa, pick up that leg. Go up. Oh, good job. Grow your tree. Grow your branches. Good job, friends. Great work. Okay, now from our mindful minute today, I was going to teach you how to do some finger breaths. Sometimes when we get nervous or mad, it's good to calm our body and take some breaths. So the way I like to do it is I put my hand out, all five fingers, and I start down here by my thumb. Can you see? Start down here by your thumb. And when you go up, you're going to breathe in. So I'm breathing in. And when you go down, breathe in. Breathe out. In. Out. In and out and in and out and then wiggle your fingers. Good job. Do you guys think you can teach someone that today? Maybe a brother or a sister or your mom or your dad or maybe you can call someone on the phone and teach them how to do it. You want to try it one more time? Okay, put your other hand out. Stretch out those fingers. Remember, when you go up, you breathe in. When you go down, you breathe out. Okay, let's see. In, out. In, out. In, out. In, out. In, out. Good job. 
job, friends. Whew. Nice and relaxed and calm. Great job. Sometimes, especially right now, we have to do a lot of waiting around. We get to have to sit in our house and maybe we have to wait for a new video to come out or wait to have a snack or wait to watch our favorite show. What are some things that you guys do while you are waiting? Oh, it's hard, so hard sometimes. Oh, I get so frustrated. I just want to do something right now. And I don't want to wait, but we all have to wait sometimes. So some things I do when I am waiting, I will, let me show you what I do. I will read a book. I can read a book while I wait. Maybe when I'm done reading, it'll be time for a snack. Or I will find some paper and I will draw a picture. Sun, flower, I can draw a picture and maybe ask mom and dad to send it to a family member or a friend. Or if I have someone with me at my house, I like to play tic-tac-toe. Few of us have played it before during nap time, rest time. Remember how you do it? X and O's. That's a good way to pass the time. What are some ways you guys wait? Maybe you can send an email and let us know some things you like to do while you're waiting. How's that sound? Okay, so we did our morning exercises. We did our yoga. We did our breathing. Hmm. Let's talk about what we're gonna do the rest of the day. Grab the camera. And we're going to look at our morning, look at our daily schedule. So school started already. We did our morning exercises and our breathing. We talked about what we're going to do while we have to wait. And then after that, we're going to have some free time, some snack. Remember, always help your family clean up. And then we're going to do special letter. We're going to do some play time. Ask your parents if you're going to play inside or outside. Then we're going to do our activity circle. Go potty and wash hands. And then it will be lunchtime. Go potty and brush teeth. Read some stories. Take a little rest. Snack. Quiet activities. Maybe play outside or in your room. Then we'll meet up with Mrs. Lorelei and have afternoon circle. And then it will be the end of our day. Sound like a plan? Okay. So, I would like you to ask your parents what activity you are able to do right now. And we will see you in a few, in a little bit for our next activity. Okay, have fun. Bye.